Welcome to Life on Tap, episode 50. I'm Dan on Tap. I know people might be wanting or expecting some sort of big regalia episode with lots of guests, lots of fancy stuff or whatnot, but you know what? You know, I want to keep it simple right now. Um, for those of you who don't know already, you don't follow me on Twitter or on Facebook or whatnot, uh, I am leaving my job. I have actually, actually, the day I'm recording this, I'm... Um, I'm less than uh, 10 days out from my last day of work. I am actually went back to school, going to get my MBA in ops management uh, over in the city at Baruch. So uh, hopefully we'll see people out and about in the city now that I am going to be a little more mobile in that area and not going to be out in the, in the burbs here in Jersey. Um, so this probably will be my very last video tasting that I'll be doing from uh, out here in Jersey. All, you'll, all my new tastings you'll see me doing hopefully in the city are going to be from my from my new place out there, so it's gonna be a little, little kind of exciting here. So, in honor of a, of a special episode and a special day, a special announcement, I wanted to go with something kind of special. What we got here is the latest from Lagunitas. It's Ruben and the Jets for the from the Frank uh, Zappa anniversary collection. Is to honor the, once again the 40th uh, anniversary release of the album. Uh, it's incredible, incredible uh, art on here. You know, it's some rather phallic noses on here of course but uh, it, it looks great so let's give this thing a shot oh wow that is pouring a nice nice dark brown wow I'd say that's like it's got a nice half inch head or so Glazing's only partially sticking the side of the glass, but it's got this nice brown color. I mean, it's kind of like really, really like a dark, you know, German um, Bach beer or something like that. Let's, let's give this thing a. Wow, well, I'm. That's like biscuity. It, this is totally. It's like bread. It's like bread and. A little bit of. I sense a little bit of sourness on the nose. I'm getting some. You know what it is? It's, you know it's 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 like it's like raisin bread. That's basically what it smells like. It smells like like raisin bread. It's crazy. Let me give it, let's give this thing a shot. Yeah, it's 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 actually really easy drinking. I'm getting a lot of I'm getting a little bit more of that biscuitiness that I'm getting off the nose. I do taste some raisins in there. There is like some other kind of um, like kind of processed uh, like uh, aged fruit in there or whatnot. I'm getting a lot of that there. I am sensing a little bit of a little bit a little bit a tiny little bit of burn on the back there, but it's nothing um, nothing too horrible. Basically, what is this thing weighing in anyway? 8.6 so I mean yeah I mean it is it is kind of up there it is a little higher than your normal range of beers basically but it's incredibly drink drinkable and the lacing is showing a little bit more right now on the glass on the side there as you see but once again I mean hats off to Lagunitas I mean I, mean, I, 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 I really love the kind of the raisin bread quality I was talking about this for it's easy it's you know the colors, the color is almost deceiving. You might expect something that's a little more, a little bit more bitter, a little more that. But, but, but the touch, a little bit of sourness that's there. But you know, mixed with the, you know, the 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 raisin and the spice, the, the kind of the spice element. It, it's more. I'd say it's like it's 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 a stout wannabe. Maybe it's it's almost like it's kind of it's kind of like that to its ending because it's nice and dark and stout, but it's not really as. Is heavier, thick as that. It's very easy drinking. I mean, you know, I would not, I wouldn't want to pound these, ever, pound these every day. Like I would definitely, not, definitely not a session beer. But you know, finishing off this bottle by myself, I'm gonna have no problem doing it tonight after the long day I've had. That's for sure. So, in any case, before I go off and do that, if you want to contact us, you can reach us at the website at www.lifeontap.net. You can email us at lifeontap at lifeontap.net. You can reach me out there on Twitter and Skype. I am New Type Two Thousand One. In fact, you can actually go to the my Facebook alias page, which now is Facebook.com/slash New Type Two Thousand One. You don't have to longer no longer look me up as uh, Daniel Fisher. And remember, life's a tap. Drink up till it's dry.